Good afternoon, everybody. It's Josh here. I wanted to talk a little bit about spin formatting. We get these questions quite a bit, so I figured I'd make a video and knock it out. Uh, spin formatting is when you take a simple sentence, like today I had a nice walk at the park, and turn it into something like this. You're usually doing this for the purpose of software. Computers, uh, computer programs will actually take all the words in curly braces that are separated by pipes, and it will pick a random one. So it could read like it does up top, or it could read this afternoon, we had too brisk of a walk in the gym. Spin formatting is useful when you're doing SEO work uh, so that you won't have the same words over and over again when you're recreating anchor text or, or some kind of article or description. Spin formatting is also useful if you want to randomly drop in links in different software. So how to get from here to there, I've got a simple search up here for eZine articles and looking around at rental foreclosure We'll uh, pick an article here, and uh, once we've got it here, we're just going to copy it. And now that we've got the paragraph or the article copy that we want to turn around and take and make spin formatted, there's a couple ways we can do this. The first one I'm going to do here is with the word AI, one of my favorite uh, software. Uh, essentially, you just go in, paste your article. I choose to use the Touring Spinner, um, so we'll just pick a regular spin format. Word AI takes a second to get finished up here, so I'm going to go ahead and copy this article again and go in and make the same spin with the best spinner. That way, if you use either software, you'll kind of have an idea of what we're trying to do. Um, I'm just going to paste that in here. Choose auto select synonyms. And I like to use the default. And once you've got that, you can see it. The best spinner has turned around and taken that simple little article and made a complex spin. What you've got here is a spin format that can be used by software programs when they unspin this. It will come up with hundreds of unique uh, articles that are basically talking about the same thing. Hopefully unique enough we're not going to trip off any filters in Google or other search engines. Back over here to Word AI. Alright, we've got what we need here. Well, this is as far as we're going to go with spin formatting. This should be the finished output that you get. Take it over to whatever software you're using and you should be able to just dump that in place and they'll be able to use it as is. I hope this helped clear some things up. If you've got any other questions, post it down in the comments.